uh, Chief of Defence Force, uh, colleagues, uh, ladies and gentlemen. Our presence here today is part of an effort to work better together in service of our shared objectives. Even if we encounter differences of approach and points of difference in the past. Working together with respect for each other's responsibilities will make us stronger. This workshop is very central for trust building and for us to be able to open a new page in how to coordinate our activities between various institutions of security of our country and the United Nations mission in South Sudan. Relatively in this across the country. We are quite heavy on the main thing. It talks about where the PFC signs are. I'm, I'm really hopeful because it is actually. I made it with the Force Commander. We made all these things, we discussed it, we made a verbal discussion, and we went for implementation until it reached this stage. So I'm very much hopeful because actually this is our mate. Both of us, myself and Yunus, made it together. And that's why the command came today. This is a great day. Peace, stability and security. Thank you very much and I look forward to a very successful event throughout the day. Thank you. Just a plan. I think we all agree that unmissed relationship with the government forces and in particular to the JVMM in the recent days is much cordial and understanding than before. It could only be possible because of very close interactions, regular visits all around, by building mutual trust, by sharing the informations at every level, leaders and staff, and solving any challenges amicably through discussion and dialogue. Quite frankly, the guidelines that have been generated have already had an impact. We've already seen improved access and a reduction in uh, what are called access denials uh, as a result uh, of this initiative. We think it's a really important opportunity to reset our relationship and build trust between the SSPDF and UNMIS, and we've seen evidence of it already. This workshop is an attempt to consolidate that. We are, uh, as a force, much more mobile than we've ever been. We are, patrols are going out all over the country to protect uh, civilians wherever they may be threatened. And the level of threat has spread throughout the country uh, and it's necessary for us uh, to have that access.